Hey everyone, it's Matt from DrawingTutorialsOnline.com. We have another sketchbook video. We actually have a gazillion sketchbooks, but we're only going to look through one of them. And you guys probably remember Vivian. And uh, Vivian has a look at these sketchbooks. I mean, those four were from semester number one. And, um, you know, I just, she brought them in. We were kind of checking them out this uh, morning here. Um, and this is a makeup class uh, for Tuesday. And basically what we have here is two sketchbooks, okay? Started this semester. I believe this one was done in a month. And uh, it's pretty darn cool. Yeah, it started on uh, Christmas Eve and ended on uh, January 28th. So it's, it's a lot of marker. And... If I camera shake, no sweat, uh, I'm going to take a lot of pictures of these and, and put them on my blog, um, Drawing Tutorials Online blog, and you guys can really check them out in depth over there. But this is crazy, this piece. Obviously, you know, Vivian was home drawing at the Christmas break, and, uh, you know, awesome stuff. The characters in this sketchbook are um, pretty darn insane. And uh, just, you know, I love the energy, I love the color. Um, and I just love the time put into the drawings. I mean, it's just, it's, it's pretty darn amazing um, to look at this stuff in, in a sketchbook. And, uh, you know, the reason why I put the, these sketchbooks up is just, you know, it just kind of gives you a feel of what other people are doing. So if you're sitting at home and not doing much, you know, <laughs> Vivian's kicking your ass. Ex excuse me for cursing, but, yeah, she's kicking your, everyone's ass doing this amount of drawings. And, uh you know, just remember, it's just sketchbook stuff. So a lot of this in the end is is really all for practice. Um, but awesome. Yeah, the color. And all this is done in marker, Vivian? Yep. Prismacolor. And Prismacolor. Prismacolor. Okay, Prismacolor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tried Kovacs ones. Yeah. See, even, you know, the pencil line is just so fluid and so fast. It's just such a good animator's line. And I um, love it. So usually for sketches, I don't spend more than, like, three minutes. Three minutes. On, like, a big one. Like, the small ones are So this page right here, how long? Two, three minutes. Two minutes. Okay. Not, not very long. Yeah, I just... The ink one's too long. Yeah, this page I really like. I mean, God, the color, the action, the movement of the composition on those angles. And again, in, in a sketchbook, not a finished illustration. So it's just pretty. It is a finished illustration, but it's in the sketchbook, and that's what blows my mind. And uh, Vivian likes yellow. I do. <laughs> I do a lot. Just some, um, the, you know, the, the good thing about this and uh, what all of you, it, and including myself, should try to do more of what Vivian does is uh, draw characters with these expressions and these movements and these subtle expressions. You know, not all of them are so over the top. Some of the characters' expressions are a little bit more subtle, and, you know, I, I think that's very difficult to do, and everyone should practice that, including me, a little bit more. But I think Vivian's like a master at these expressions and, and these movements. And this is just such a fun page. I mean, I suggested to Vivian that she does a blog just all in the white, uh, well, the, the black and the yellow. I think that would be so striking to look at that. Yeah, and remember, guys, if I'm um, going too fast for you, um, there's always a pause button. And uh, I'll, pu I'll put some pictures on the, on the blog, definitely, so you can look at them a little bit in bigger detail. Great stuff. Where this was? Animals. This? Uh, I did those from a book. Okay. Those were really fast. Those were like thirty seconds. Okay. I just had the book open. I was like, I need a full page. Draw animals. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I, guys, I can't, you know, we're not even like halfway through this. This is insanity. I'm just going from the front a little slow here. And, uh, you know, I'll speed up in, in a touch. But 
I wanted to go show you guys some of those uh, marker drawings in the beginning and then just going back to the color uh, I'm sorry the colored pencil and let's let's go from the back now let's go from the back because I can flip a little better from the it's back like unfinished picture of the color and I was like Ugh. oh wow that's so that's one big composition yeah, I see. It's, it's, it, might, it might be I don't know, I don't know. okay Yeah, I, it's um, I'm I'm holding a makeup class before my Saturday pre-college class, and three uh, students have showed up so far to the makeup class. And Vivian came with all of her sketchbooks, and I was like, we have to we have to film, we have to film. Like it's just uh, insanity, insanity. All these drawings shoved into one page, two pages. Love it. And, you know, for me, uh, being a teacher and running the two websites, the painting site and the drawing site, uh, you know, it's, it's inspiring to see uh, somebody like Vivian, because she's got you know, 18 credits here, 18 credit course load at, at SVA, and she's finding the time to do all these drawings in, in her sketchbook. And, um, you know, I, I find that, that is, that's good inspiration for me, too, to kind of get my butt in and, and, and do my own drawings in, in my own sketchbooks. Um, you know, and not just do drawings in, in my pads, but just carry the sketchbooks with you everywhere. And just, uh, this is um, some compositional studies for a big piece that I'll show you in a moment. Uh, you know, I was making everyone do three value studies of their sketches and, um, hold on, let me see if there's any more. Oh, there's a bunch. There's all my crappy ideas. Yeah, so more ideas. Yeah, maybe do it for the color piece. Um, and so I'm just going to move away from the sketchbook for a second. And basically, this is um, Vivian's big black and white piece. It actually looks really good, Vivian, small. Uh, so this is uh, done in the Prismacolor marker. Yes. Yeah, so I was getting everybody to try to do a piece where uh, they control where the viewer looks first, second, and third. Um, and so Vivian's pretty much almost finished. There's a couple things that we're going to uh, tweak perhaps, but I just want to share that with you because some of you guys have been asking me, well, do your students just draw on the sketchbooks? And absolutely not. I mean, we do these other types of projects in class. So I just want to share that with you. And the genesis of that piece came um, from, you know, the, the assignment, but, you know, it's worked out in, in the sketchbook first. All right, so this is one that um, I think is, yeah, it's very cool. So the reason why we do black and white first is because black and white is just 80% of your image, and then we're going to do color next. Yeah, this looks amazing. This is just a fun page to look at. This one I'm definitely going to photograph and put it on the blog. And uh, if anyone's interested in, in commissioning uh, Vivian to do anything, you know, come to my blog, and I'll have a link to her uh, Deviant page. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll have a link to her Deviant page and um, you guys can check it out there. And, and I'll have a link to my blog at, at the end of this uh, video. So I think we're going to put this sketchbook to rest. And um, I think there's a lot in here. I mean, I just, every page that I turn to, I just see like a little gem of a drawing that I want to sit with and just stare at for a couple seconds and be like, wow, that's really nice stuff. And again, all the the, the expression. So that's my challenge to you guys out there watching this on YouTube and also a challenge to myself to try to draw not just people, but people with expression and movement and subtlety and also interaction. Interacting, um, like just the little interaction between these two is, uh, you know, really just fun to watch. So it's, that's a talent all into its own, doing, you know, these expressions. And uh, just practice it. Last page in the sketchbook. And like another, another question that I personally, I get a lot is how did you make your style? And I'm just like, well, you, you, you learn from like other artists and you keep drawing. And if you draw like just, I mean, you can start in somebody else's style, but branch like, Grab things from different stuff and mm. develop it. <laughs> yeah. I'm sort of tired of saying it. Yeah, yeah. So. Okay, we'll look at a couple in here. This We're is the one I just started uh, three days ago. 
three days ago. Okay, so that was just very... Or not even, maybe, maybe it was two days ago, because I did my animation homework. So maybe it was two days ago. I did most of these last night, to be honest. I did like four pages last night, because mm. we were all in the, in the animation class, and like my, my roommate, my roommate did this, Corey did that. Um, I had some seniors, Zach. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Zach did that, um, Luce, and then I just doodled around them because I wanted to fill the pages up. Cool. Um, so this is just more classmates drawing? Yeah, well, I did, um, no, Mike, uh, Mike Rocco did that one, and then I did a bunch of caricatures of people. Nice. Okay, well, Vivian, I want to thank you guys. Let's just kind of make a stack here before we end, and we're going to pay homage to the stack of sketchbooks done in five short months. Um, nice. All right, Vivian, thank you so much for sharing your artwork. No problem. And if you guys want to see more artwork of Vivian's or a link to her um, Deviant page, visit Drawing Tutorials Online blog, and I'll talk to you guys soon.